So what is fahash and what is the opposite of the fahash? Is haya. Either you are a shameful person or either you are a shameless person. A, a believer, he cannot be sh shameless. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, if you don't have haya, then you can do what you like. If you don't have the shame, it is how much far you to be a Muslim. You are not even a human being. You are just a filthy animal. For example, today in the media is very powerful. Even in these cell phones, we have too much shamefulness, shamelessness. Lots of fahash or the shamelessness in our cell phones today. You need to always to be watchful. cell phone. It's a television, because if you keep on seeing the shame, shamelessness, the fahash, it will corrupt your mind, it will corrupt your heart, and it will destroy your iman. One of the things which can destroy your iman, it is watching the shameless things, fahash. Shameless things can destroy you to your iman, and you can might be die as a disbeliever. A young man cannot make zina, adultery, unless he keep on watching dirty things. When he keep on watching dirty things, then he will be initiated to, com to do commit the zina. For as a believer, when he sees the shameless thing, he will turn away his eyes. He will not look at it. Or he will look down. You are going in the market, you are going in the bank, you are going in the street. You see a woman wearing the shameless dress. What you should do? You look at her? No. You are a believer, you look down. Don't look at her. Because she is shameless. And if you look at her, your eyes will see this dirty the woman wearing the bad clothes, almost half naked, and if you look at her, it will go to your heart. It will damage your heart. You're watching the movie, and you see the dirty things there, fahash, shameless things, and you keep on watching, it will destroy your heart. Your salah will be useless. You will not be happy to pray. You're praying, fasting, no use, because your heart is corrupted. But when your heart is clean, you're not watching the dirty, you're not watching the pornography, you're not watching the fahash, your heart will be always clean. And that heart can remember Allah. The remembrance of Allah will not come to the dirty heart. Remembrance of Allah can come to the clean heart. So when you watch the dirty, you hear the dirty stuff, the shameless things, you watch it, the shameless words, you hear it, the shameless things you thought, it all affects your heart. Your heart will become shameless heart. No remembrance of Allah. We as a believers, when we stand up, we like to pray more because it's enjoyable. We love it. Because we are in front of our God who give us life. So we are standing down, bow down, making sujood. We feel happy. We feel sukoon in our heart. But the person who is dirty, who is filthy, he will not be happy to pray. He like to finish pray quickly and then run away because heart is already corrupted. There is a one surah of the Quran, Surah Al Shams. What is it? Kadaflaha man zakkaha. Surely the successful is the person who clean himself. Allah swear for 16 to 17 times. Then Allah is saying, Surely the person is successful who clean himself. How you can be clean? You are watching pornography. How you can be clean now? Before there is a CD and DVD, and the Muslims are watching the board, selling. Muslims are selling the board CD, the pornography, X-rated, for 10 pesos. They sell their iman for 10 pesos. Their iman is not worthy of 10 pesos. Allah doesn't need this kind of iman. But now no CD, DVD. Now is the internet, everything with internet. Now. They don't like to pray anymore. Even they pray, their prayer is an exercise only because their heart is corrupted. What Allah said? Kadaflaha man zakkaha. Surely is a successful is the one who clean himself. Clean the heart, clean the mind, clean your eyes, clean your hands. No dirty, any kind of dirt. And what Allah said the next? Kadaflaha man zakkaha wa man dasaha. And surely the destroyer is the one who corrupt himself, who dirty himself. So it is a very big problem in the world today. The young generation are being corrupted with these pornographies with dirty things in the internet. They keep on watching and they enjoy it, but they don't know they are bringing themselves to the hellfire. Because it is the way to going to hellfire. Because shaitan, he commands people for fahash and for evil. And Allah said, I, Allah command people for haya, for the shamefulness and for the goodness. So be shameful and don't be shameless.